chapter three, Mishnah two. Mishnah two. We learned in the previous chapter that not only does one, not only does a corpse transmit tuma by means of ohel, but even a ladle full of corpse dust and a revius of blood from a corpse transmits tuma as well. See Mishnahs one and two in chapter one. Our Mishnah gives more details about these laws. If a ladle full of corpse dust, the dust that remains after corpse is decomposed, was scattered inside a house and became mixed with some of the dirt from the floor, the house, i.e., any person or item that is in the house is Tommy, although the corpse dust is mixed with the dirt from the floor, it is not nullified. Thus again, transmit to me through Ohel, and all the contents of the house become Tommy. But Rabbi Shimon rules that the contents of the house are Tahor. According to Rabbi Shimon, a ladle full of corpse dust transmits Tuma only when nothing else is mixed with it, with it. Since some of the dirt from the floor became mixed with the corpse dust, it cannot transmit Tuma and the items inside the house remain Tahor. If a revius of blood from a corpse was absorbed into the dirt of a floor of a house, into the dirt floor of a house, the house is Tahor, i.e. any person or utensil that entered the house after the blood became absorbed remained Tahor. Since once the blood is absorbed in the ground, it no longer transmits Tuma. And a revius of blood was absorbed into a garment, the law depends. And if a revius of blood was absorbed in a garment, the law depends. If a revius of blood came out when the garment is washed, the garment is Tame, and it is brought into a house without being washed. Sorry. If a revius of blood comes out when the garment is washed, the garment is Tame. And if it is brought into a house without being washed, all the items in the house become Tame through Ohel. But if a revius of blood does not come out when the garment is washed, the garment is Tahor, i.e. does not transmit Tuma by means of Ohel. Because anything Tame that is absorbed and cannot come out in the normal manner of washing is Tahor. Therefore, whether a revius of blood was absorbed into the floor of the house or whether it was absorbed into the garment and cannot be removed, it was absorbed into a garment and cannot be removed by washing it, no longer transmits Tuma.